Hello and welcome to a video where I'm putting up this wireless Mighty Mule keypad and this is part of the series where I'm installing an automatic gate, building a gate, building the stucco columns and putting up solar panel and putting up lights on the stucco columns. So if you want to see the full series of this, subscribe and then go check out the playlist of all the videos and I will see you in those videos. But let's jump into this install. I haven't installed one of these before, but they have directions. So I bought this from Amazon. I'll have a link in the description along with all the other stuff that I purchased for this build and these builds. Um, so if you want to get it, check it out there. Besides that, so the first thing we did was open up the keypad with the two small screws. And then we put the batteries in and now we're going to sync up this transmitter. I gotta figure out how to do that. Before we get too far into this video, I just wanted to let y'all know that I did run into two issues here. So watch to the end of the video to make sure you don't run into the same mistakes and you program your controller perfectly. You're gonna press and release the program button, the bottom left button, hit the master code which is on your instructions, hit the program again, type in 05, and then press the button again, and then hold the transmitter up against the keypad. And then voila. Ah, uh, gotta move. <laughs> okay, that seemed to all work just fine. I thought I had just set a new master key, but I really didn't. What I did just do was to sync my transmitter to the keypad. This is a necessary step and you have to do it. I will show you in a second how to set a new master code and a new entry code. But let's hang this up onto this pole, which is right outside my gate. And there's uh, two little holes in here and it comes with screws and anchors if you need those. Alrighty, now for the test we're going to close it. We're going to open it with the opener. That was the wrong code, just testing to make sure it doesn't open if I typed in the wrong one. All right, it's not synced up. <laughs> Let me go check it. Okay, the issue is that I was trying to program a new master code when in reality, I wasn't doing it according to the directions. So this is how you program a new master code. You just have to press uh, 06 instead of 05, so let's do that. To do this, you're gonna press the program key Enter your master code, press the program button again, press 06, press the program button again, and then you're going to type your new master code, which I just set an example here, and then press the program button again, and then retype in your code, and then press the program button again, and then you should be good. That new master code worked, it's just these. Now adding a new entry code with O2 function. Cool, and then that should work. And it works, yeah. The trick here is that the master code is set until you change the master code with the 06 key and not the 05 key. So make sure you flip the page on the direction and then you can plug in the new master code, you can add a temporary code, you can add a new entry code, you can delete an entry code, you can delete all entry codes, that's about it. So one thing to note here is when you open the gate with the code, then you can press any button and it will open or close it. So it'll beep like that, and then you're reset and you're locked up. So I don't see that in the directions, but maybe it's there. I'll probably look into it more and then show it on the screen if I find out something. The directions do say once a valid code is entered, there is 40 seconds before it goes back into idle mode. And during those 40 seconds, any key press will activate the gate in some way. So. That about sums up this video. Let's wait till that quiets down. 
that about sums up this video. Thank y'all for watching. Let me know in the comments if you need help setting up your keypad. It was a little bit more confusing than I thought, but if you're interested in the rest of these builds, go check them out in this video or check out some of my other builds. I'll link one here and I will see y'all out there. Make sure you subscribe. Alrighty, see you later.